around. <laughs> and maybe meet the first pen you ever got from the governor. Strawberry Mansion. Thank you. There you go. Right here. That's it. That's it. <laughs> Hard work and determination of so many who champion. Let me begin by saying um, thank you to my good friend Meek Mill. I want you to know, man, I've been inspired. First, we're showing that we believe in second chances here in the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. And when someone gets a second chance, that should be a real opportunity to start over and succeed. Some minor conviction from just a few years ago, that shouldn't prevent someone from getting a job or renting an apartment, especially if that person has already received a pardon from the Commonwealth. Now, thanks to a bill that I signed into law yesterday, Pennsylvanians who receive a pardon will get their criminal records cleared automatically here in the Commonwealth. Stop believing. Leaders inside and out of the And so we are taking common sense steps to remove these unnecessary barriers for Pennsylvanians who want to rebuild their lives and who want to meaningfully contribute to our communities. And because of these bills, more people will get to spend the holidays with their families, more parents will get the jobs they wanted, more people will get back up on their feet. Uh, it's a lot today. I wanted to say thank you to everyone here today. Uh, you, don't, you, don't, you don't gotta clap because I'm at a point in my life like we all grew up in the streets and we try to be better, but they labeled us felons, mm -hmm. sent us back to jail. I had to fight against that the whole time to gain my respect and be who I am today, and I'm proud of that. And I'm right here in the city of Philadelphia. They came together to get this common sense reform done. So I want to say to my friend Meek and... A new perspective as I'm looking around. We argued, we debated. 